Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Behavior here for another trailer reaction. And this one just came out of nowhere. Just a, I thought it was going to be a regular Friday. I was at work, looked at my phone, saw the new teaser uh, poster that came out. And then they said the trailer, a teaser trailer, is going to drop during the game for the NBA Finals. I was like, what the hell? Okay, that's great. Makes my Friday even better. I honestly didn't think that we were going to uh, see this trailer or the first uh, real piece of footage until Comic-Con that comes out in July, like a month and a half half from now since this comes out in February of next year but I guess they just wanted to uh, you know get the buzz going especially during the NBA Finals so I'm really excited I, I'm trying to keep my expectations low for this trailer because it's just a teaser and the movie comes out so far away but I'm real excited uh, I can't wait to see this movie and I haven't even seen the trailer yet so let me uh, put on these headphones and um, you can stop listening to me talk but watch me watch the trailer here we go. Tell me something. What do you know about Wakanda? Uh, it's a third world country. Textiles, shepherds, cool outfits. All the front. Explorers have searched for it. Called it El Dorado. They looked for it in South America. But it was in Africa the whole time. I'm the only one who's seen it. Man. And made it out alive. Ah! Oh, man! The world is changing. Soon there will only be the conquered <laughs> and the conquerors. Step into the spotlight. You are a good man. Step into man. the spotlight. With a good heart. And it's hard for a good man to be a king. Damn. <laughs> oh my gosh. We are watching that again. We are watching that again. Okay. Oh my goodness. Tell me something. What do you know about Wakanda? It's a third world country. Textiles, shepherds, cool outfits, all the front. Explorers have searched for it. Called it El Dorado. They looked for it in South America. But it was in Africa the whole time. Blows the Quinn jet away. I bet. You see it. Child doing in my hood. <laughs> ah. It's like, what are you doing? <laughs> Can't touch me. He's so fluid with it too. so smooth with like I got this I'm you know I'm not even nervous I know I was gonna make it oh I'm in love 
Man, it is going down. I love it. And that's just a teaser trailer? Are you serious? It just looked so freaking lovely. Uh, I don't know about Michael B. Jordan's hairstyle there. That w did look a little crazy, but my goodness gracious. As soon as they showed that waterfall, all those waterfalls, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't know. Like, Wakanda is the most advanced civilization on the whole freaking planet in every way that you can think of. And this blew my expectations away. I mean, I knew that it was going to look great, but no, they, that like, that uh spaceship looking thing or whatever that was floating and then just shot off into the screen or whatever. I mean, I, I just kind of want to see that in a Quinjet, you know, flying around the world, you know, see what, uh, which one is the fastest. But man, I love this trailer. It looked freaking amazing. Um, seeing uh, Black Panther in the woods up on that mountain, like just the perfect ninja that will even whoop Batman's ass. I mean, it just looks great. Uh, I can't wait to see that. Uh, something else in the trailer. Uh, it looks like towards the end when the character pulled the knives or daggers or axes out of his back uh, that he may have been trying to attack Black Panther. And that was possibly the Dora Milaje uh, that was protecting him that had, all on, uh, had on all the red. Can't wait to see that. Um, I just like the way that Claw... Uh, set it up in the beginning, you know, just kind of telling the myth of Wakanda, just like, hey, you know, they thought this was over here in South America. People have been looking for this place for uh, the longest time. It's been in Africa. I'm the only person that's seen it. I mean, he takes pride in that. You know, he, he's like, he didn't even care that he was caught. He was just like, you know, I'm I'm one that's seen it or whatever. And Chadwick Boseman, Black Panther, did look really concerned, like, dang, I don't want all my secrets getting out. And Claw is like, you know, a crazy villain uh, with, you know, he got his hand chopped off by Ultron in Avengers Age of Ultron, and that's exactly how it happened in the comics. Well, not by Ultron, but his hand did get cut off in the comics, and he gets it replaced by some mechanical, bionicle uh, sound device. And, you know, he, he's a he just a crazy villain that's known around the world, just effing up everything. So I think he's going to pose a worthy threat, especially Michael B. Jordan. And I forgot the name of Michael B. Jordan's character that he's playing in the movie. He's playing a villain. Um, but what is the name of the villain? Uh, Eric Killamonger. And also at the very end, they may have been Michael B. Jordan holding up the thing, but they also kind of like uh, M'Baku the man ape. Um He's a villain that kind of, you know, takes his stuff from an ape or whatever. Don't know too much about him, just a little bit. But, you know, uh, guys, I'm just super freaking excited about this trailer. Uh, I cannot wait. I want to go to the red carpet to see this movie so bad. But, you know, guys, that's just my opinion of the new Black Panther teaser trailer. What did you think about it? You know, are you excited as I am? Do you not care at all? Do you agree with me or do you disagree with me? Let me know in the comment section below. Let's get this conversation going and keep it flowing. And guys, you already know I'm going to see it because I've been seeing it in my past videos. But now we're here. Today was a Friday surprise. I want to go to the red carpet premiere of this movie right here, Black Panther, that comes out February 16th of 2018. You know I love Marvel. You know I love Black Panther. You know I love comics. I'm Black, Black History Month. Just a perfect combination dream come true for me. I mean, it, you know, I was going to say, is it a long shot if I go? No, I'm going. I'm speaking this into existence. You know, I, I just don't care. I'm going to drop all my plans. And whether if I'm on the red carpet or if I'm on the side with the fans, I don't care. I just want to be there. I'm going to take vacation. If I don't got that, I'm calling in sick. And if I can't do that, I'm quitting my job. I don't care because I'm just not going to miss this. I mean, I'm just not. I'm just, you know, super duper excited for it. Also, if you like this video, go ahead and give me the thumbs up. And if you don't like this video, that's perfectly fine. Just leave me a comment below why and still give me the thumbs up. Since you're here on YouTube, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel so you can get all the content that I have to provide. You can go to my website, book market, check me out there and also look me up on social media. But guys, I just want to thank you again for tuning in for my opinion slash reaction for the Black Panther teaser trailer. And before you go, don't forget that my name is Brennan Keith Avery. And that's just my opinion. Peace.